Hello guys and welcome to another profile tree video. So today we're going to be covering some of the best Chrome video downloader extensions. So without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get started. So before we even get looking into some of the Chrome extensions, what exactly is it? So Chrome extensions are basically a way to improve a user experience or modify and add functionality to the Chrome browser. They're created using web technology like HTML, CSS, or JavaScript. But of course, this isn't really something you need to know. It's more of how, how it's actually been made. Anyway, the aim of the extension is to serve a single purpose around which the whole program is built. An extension should have minimal interface or extend to a web page. Extensions are zipped into a CRX package the user would have to download and install the package so as it says uh, of course you guys may have heard of some chrome extensions like honey or even ones that are like an ad blocker so those are chrome extensions they help your user experience basically especially if you're blocking ads or trying to look for discounts stuff like that that are available on the chrome web store but what we really want to cover here is What's the best video downloader for Chrome extensions? So we'll have a look at uh, three here. And on top of that, we'll actually check out the Chrome uh, extension tool itself. And we'll go ahead and explore it. So our first extension here, uh, video downloader extension, is called Video Download Helper. Now, this extension is perfect for downloading videos. It uh, can easily detect video playing from the other site. As well as that, it can quickly uh, see any videos playing on a website that you visited and make it downloadable. This tool also supports 1080p resolutions. Now, of course, it's got its pros and cons. Now, with the pros, it allows you to download a video from the quality of the original source. So that's great, especially if you want to maintain that quality. This would probably be the best video extension, uh, video downloader extension to use. It's also available on Mac, Linux, and Windows computers, which is great. So a variety of different devices. However, there is a small delay when downloading multiple videos. What we'll do is we'll go ahead and check out the video downloader and see it for ourselves. So this is the video download helper. Now you won't actually find this in the Chrome extension. However, you will actually find it just within a separate website um now you can just select uh, install now it shows you the different uh versions there which is the uh, on chrome for firefox or on edge and it also shows you the video sites that are available basically for downloading and quite a few there as you can see so that lists from youtube daily motion facebook vimeo streamcloud uh there's putlocker there twitter as well and let's see if there's any other ones that we know of. So these are some of, there's UDMY. So there, there, there is quite a few different uh, areas for you to download. And I've had, it looks like they go throughout a couple of different uh, ones there. Even one for Netflix. Of course, you may not want to pirate a couple of stuff. Um, this is purely great for sourcing out those video needs now you also get some support which is great and you can contribute if you want to you can also pay for the premium version so the uh, video conversion so it looks like you have um converted videos it won't hold the download helper qr code you will be able to convert videos directly to mp3 audio files you will have access to support for the uh, conversion feature, no restriction on HLS downloads. And of course you could pay that in US dollars or euros. Now we'll go ahead and check out the installer and we'll download it from the um, area here. So it looks like, so overlooking that uh, video downloader, unfortunately that one uh, seems to be unavailable. But what is as similar uh, to that one is the Opa video downloader. Now, uh, you can also download videos embedded as HTML5 and videos from open websites. So 
you can work with other other um, softwares or other uh, websites. However, it does say that it doesn't work on major websites such as YouTube. And it just so happens to be because of the Chrome Web Store policies, which which does make sense, which is uh, understandable. But uh, what's great is that you can still use it on Vimeo. And I assume that'll work with other different platforms as well. Just don't use it on, of course, the major websites, which is YouTube. Of course, there's some copyright uh, involved in that, hence why it's not available. Uh, so that's pretty much what that looks like. This is the upper video downloader. And all you would need to do is just add that to Chrome. And then you would add that as an extension. And that pretty much just takes a little minute there, gives you a little yellow bar at the bottom. And then it just adds it onto the Chrome, as you can see. So manage your extensions by clicking extensions in the tools menu and to get your extensions on all computers, turn your sync on. So that's pretty much just what that is. And then of course you can choose to remove that from Chrome if you want to. Now, if we check it out here and go to manage our extensions, uh, just right there is the Oppa video downloader. And you can just view the details if you want to and see what your permissions you can access and then if you do want to remove the extension just select remove and as simple as that it just gets rid of the extension itself so unfortunately uh i was talking about the that extension there uh however it is unavailable but the next one to closest to it is the oppa video downloader we'll move on to our next downloader Okay, so our next one here is the Video Downloader Unlimited. Now, this extension allows you to download videos into several websites online. You can export them to your preferred format, like an MP4. So this extension tool is perfect for you to download multiple videos because it doesn't consume the computer's disk space. Now, of course, with the pros, it supports resolutions such as 1080p and 720p. It can quickly detect videos from other um, from different websites, sorry. And of course, with the cons, it's the same as the other one. It's a small delay when downloading multiple videos. Now we'll go ahead and take a look at this extension. So uh, I've just searched it up there for the video downloader ultimate uh, or unlimited. And so that's pretty much it there. It's one of the featured ones. Uh, so all you would need to do is just click on it. Of course, there is a couple of uh, ways to do so. and. All you need to do is add that to Chrome, add that as an extension. Now, what's great, it looks like you can use it for Facebook. So we'll just get a quick overview of it. So it, it allows you to download MP4, WebM, M, uh, MPEG, uh, OGG, etc. Also allows you to download HTTP live streaming. And just pretty much there's a couple of different areas there. So. How do you use the video downloader? Just go uh, to Facebook or Instagram or find videos and photos you want to download. Uh, click to the video downloader icon, press the download button in for every video and start download and save into the PC. So then again, it is right here. Uh, so it's saying that no videos are detected for this site. So what we could do is we'll check out to see if where we can actually download a video. Okay, so basically uh, what you would do is you would just go to the extensions on the top. Now, it is a little bit hard to see at the minute. I'll actually see if I could adjust this. So just a little icon there uh, within this extensions. And then all you would need to do is select uh, the video download unlimited. And then that, that pretty much then enables you to download anything that you want. So this is the daily motion and pretty much you'll be able to download a video that you'd like to catch up on. So that's pretty much as easy as it goes. Now, of course, there are several different uh, available video downloaders out there and the list pretty much just goes on. So to enable to actually find what you're looking for, just make sure you enter the Chrome Web Store. And then if you're searching for an extension, all you just need to do is search up video downloader. And uh, just make sure that you filter out uh, the, or filter the extensions and you will get several different ones available. So we have one here, which is the video downloader professional. And it just shows how to do this. So it finds the video files for you. And then you can, 
as it states, there's a couple of different instructions there. Uh, so pretty much just look through the different video downloaders available that Chrome has to offer. And of course you could go by ratings as well, depending or. So the, it looks like the video da downloader uh, Coconut, oh, Coco Cut, sorry, is uh, one of the more popular ones. And by the looks of things as well, you can or should be able to download videos from Vimeo or any other platform that shows a video. So as you can see, it detects MP4 files, um, FLV, HLV, WebM, MOV, or MKV. So that's the different formats that I can support. Now you could add simply just add that to the Chrome and then add extension. Now I, I would like to manage an extension actually and just delete one out. So if I remove the video one. So that's that actually fully downloaded as well. So basically just tells me to use the little coconut on the top there. So we'll test it out and see if it works. So let's see. Uh, we'll use it for the daily motion, go to extensions, and then we could force a download. So basically, if there's no file detected, you can force downloads. So just depending, of course, if there are any MP4 files available within the site, then it'll detect that. And then you could just go ahead and download it. But as I said, guys, I keep going on uh, with the different available video downloaders that's available on the Chrome Web Store. Uh, but I would highly suggest this just to go ahead and check them out for yourselves and just see which one you would prefer. Uh, hopefully this video has helped to just even check out the different ones available. And if you never knew the, the, uh, the Chrome Web Store offers it, there you go. Uh, if I have missed anything, please do let me know in the comment section below. But other than that, I'll see you guys for the next video. Thank you very much.